Micro society is a microcosm of Canadian society, so it replicates what's going on in Canadian society. So the children participate in government, they participate in a, a non-government organization called an NGO, they participate in a bank, they need a bank, we need a police force, so they all have a job, they have to earn wages, they pay taxes, so it's just a replication of Canadian society in the school setting. I think that today is our really our first big step in micro society. The children are giving their candidate speech, speeches for the Prime Minister and Deputy Prime Minister positions, and within the classrooms they're electing their own member of parliament. It can be a nerve-wracking thing to get up in front of your whole school and talk about what they want to do in terms of their leadership in micro village. But the reason that each one of them are doing it is because they want to be a leader and because they want to make a difference in our school. Um, we saw a lot today of a lot of nerves and a lot of excitement and I think the idea of public speaking is important but public speaking for a purpose and the kids that are do going to be speaking today are driven to take this risk and it's a good way for them to practice their public speaking but also for them to be able to um, show other kids how to show leadership in the school and in the classroom. Hi, my name is Owen Zahoko and I'm running for Prime Minister of Micro Village. I've been a student here for five years, kindergarten to grade four, and I think this is the best school. The staff and students are amazing here and I wish I could stay here forever. I intend to do the right things by taking this job very seriously and I will stand up for Micro Village and each student at Parkland Village School. I am prepared to do whatever the Prime Minister says to get the job done. One thing that we're hoping to build on a lot today is uh, resiliency. Today, students will be speaking to the whole school, and that's something that's definitely difficult for them, but only two of the 15 students speaking will be elected, which doesn't mean there aren't lots of other leadership opportunities available for them through being manager or assistant manager of ventures, but we have to help build on students that even though you've tried your hardest, sometimes you don't get things and that's okay. Then we just keep trying and we learn from the experience. And that really mimics real life. I think a lot of times in schools we try and make it as fair as possible, but we have to understand that fair isn't always equal. Sometimes some kids try really hard and get something and sometimes they don't. But we will be um, conscious of that and make sure that there's lots of leadership opportunities so that kids don't feel uh, negatively about micro society. Parkland School Division, where the world opens up.